Hey guys, hello everyone and welcome to the channel. So today I'm going to talk about a program for scholars. Uh, this is an exchange program uh, organized by India, uh, Indo-US Science and Technology Forum that is called as IUSSTF. Now this particular organization has uh, made different uh, programs for the Indian scholars so that they can pursue their higher education in US and US based institutes. So this program named is Khurana program. Okay, so this is named uh, after a famous scientist who has got Nobel Prize in uh, biotechnology. So basically, uh, Department of Biotechnology, Government of India is going to organize it. So you can see over here the Department of Biotechnology (DBT), Government of India, and Indo-US Science and Technology Forum (IUSSTF) and Win Step Forward are part to support the prestigious Khurana program for a scholar named in or, honor of Dr. Har Gobind Khurana who won the Nobel Prize in 1968 for his work in uh, interface of chemistry and biology while a member of University of uh, Wisconsin Medicine faculty. Okay, so, so many things are there about the program. Uh, let's come down for the objective of it. So, the objective of this particular program is to provide an opportunity to Indian students to gain exposure and access to the world class research facilities uh, for promoting research and capacity building in biotechnology and LED areas to encourage post graduate students to take up research as a career and paving the way for the next generation scientists and technologists toward building a long term sustainable R&D uh, linkage and collaborations. Right? And uh, if you come a little down, it says application should be submitted using the online application portal and hard copies and electronic copies of the application forms will not be accepted. So basically they are asking you to apply it. I'll explain you how to apply and all. But the last date of submission is 15th of January 2023. This is very important to know that what exactly is the last date of it. All right. So you should be aware about it. Other contact informations are there. So if you need any information, you can mail on this particular or you can visit this particular website. Uh, you can email also on this for any uh, assistance. All right. Now let's talk about eligibility and funding. Okay. So eligibility is that you should be a pre-final year student enrolled in either B.Tech, M.Tech, B.Sc, M.Sc, B.E, M.E, M.S, Integrated B.S.M.S, B.V.Sc, M.V.Sc, B.Pharma, M.Pharma, M.B.B.S, Masters in med uh, Medical. Science and Technology at recognized institute or higher education in India in biotechnology and LED areas. Now, what are LED areas? So, either you should be in your biotechnology sub uh, subject or you should be uh, like LED areas are including agricultural, food health, biomedical sciences, interdisciplinary areas like computational sciences, big data, machine learning, etc. Okay, so if you have done masters or if you have done BTEC or all these. Uh, so like topics are there, like all these uh, uh, courses are there. So if you have done any of these, you are eligible to apply. First year, final year and PhD students are not eligible to apply. Now understand that first year of BTEC, first year of BSc, these people are not eligible. But yeah, if you are in second year, uh, then all you are eligible. Even if you are in the final year, then also you are not eligible. So they are not taking very fresh students and they are not taking those students who are in the final year because they have to give exams and all. So that's why. First year and final year students are not eligible, even PhD students are not eligible to apply for it. Application in subject field uh, other than those specified above will not be considered. So it again says that uh, other subjects are not considered, fine. The applicant should have, uh, these are the basic criteria which they want, cumulative grade point average that is CGPA of 8 or higher or you should have percentage of 80% and higher in your uh, whatever degree you are doing. Minimum of 65% and higher if the applicant is in MBBS student. Okay. Now for complete application guidelines, refers to the uh, resources section. So fine, that is another thing. Now let's talk about funding. So the program is going to support everything depending upon round trip airfare, means you don't have to pay for the fare as well. You will be provided with a certain stipend over there and you will be also given health insurance. Now in India, we don't bother much about health insurance, but in foreign countries, especially in US and Europe, uh, health insurance is very very important and uh, no course or nothing nobody is admitted over there without having a proper health insurance so all these three things which are major funding is issues where a lot of money is being basically uh, you have to pay a lot of money those all things are covered in this particular funding now uh, let's come to the next thing that is award 
so this is for 2020 award okay uh, like if you look upon it so there are different like every year it used to happen 2017 18 19 20 after 20 it didn't happen in 2021 now it is being organized in 2022 so one year gap was taken just because of uh, you know uh, covid so that's why it was not done in the last year uh, resources section you can read about the other things like faqs brochure guidelines so many things are there you can click on them and read about it in detail okay so i'll give you link of all these uh, like all these pages in the description of this video so that you can come up over here and read about them now let me take you to the application portal so if you click on this link you will be taken to this page uh, which is basically um, uh, online application portal for uh, visitation programs okay now you can see that Korana program for a scholars call for 2023 announced if you click on that you will be taken to this particular page now here again all the basic things are there um, uh, we have already read about this scholarship includes what this uh, fellowship program is about eligibility again same thing is here and yeah program days is between May to July 2023 all right so this is the date uh, this is between the time when you will you have to visit us and you have to go over there for this particular program last date is 15th of january as i have told you application guidelines are here you can read about it what are the steps what are the things which you have to do so everything is mentioned over here in the first step you have to sign in through the online application portal in the second step you have to verify your account by basically you have to verify your email in the third step you have to log in the application portal using your email and the password in the fourth step you have to start the application fill the required details which you are there then uh, you can save the details over there you have to basically uh, submit the form once you complete everything and you have you can download the completed application form after making the sub uh, like submission okay uh, all other things which are included regarding filling of the application form are over here you can read about it yeah for this you need a referee in in that uh, a host over there in a particular institute so i'll suggest you to read about this whole thing what are the necessary things and all and if you have any doubt you can ask in the comment sections below so yeah that's what it uh, it is about faqs are there frequently asked questions a lot of questions of yours will be answered if you read this faqs okay so read about it very carefully these are awardees of the previous years so if you want to see the list how many get selected and in which institutes they get selected everything is over there contact us may you can just go and just you know these are the numbers and this is the email in which you can ask if you have any doubt right now if you are ready enough and one more thing that this program is for 10 to 12 weeks so that means around three months it's a three month program and uh, this will give you opportunity to the indian student to undertake research in the leading u.s universities over summer 2023 for 10 to 12 weeks right now if you are okay with everything if you have read everything you can now click on this apply now and now you can click on app start application form so once you click on this they will ask you to you know uh, log in or sign up so just sign up over here fill your name mobile number email address password confirm password select indian applicant if you are and just click over here and sign up once you sign up then the other steps you have to follow over there so i'm not going to do that i'm not going to sign up from with my details but i'm just telling you that how it needs to be done all right so it's a very good program and it's a very good opportunity if you are uh, if you follow or if you if you fulfill the eligibility criteria I will highly recommend you to go for it. It's a very good opportunity to experience research and experience, you know, how research is being carried out outside India, especially in US in the peer universities over there. So yeah, if you are uh, if you are full, fulfilling the eligibility, do apply for it. Give it a try, and uh, all the best for this particular team. So thank you so much for watching this video. And if you want more such videos, do let me know in the comment sections below. Please subscribe the channel so that you get notified by whenever the next video get uploaded. And that's all from my side. Thank you so much for watching. See you in the next one. Till then, have a great day. Bye-bye. Take care.